Friends stay close. Friends in the tribe, stay closer. In the tribe, you always know what's up with Facebook, WhatsApp, BB, and Twitter. There are no rules with SMS. It's endless. Enjoy very long conversations with that special someone. Enjoy endless connections to your friends with free calls, free WhatsApp, Twitter, Facebook, and BBM. You also enjoy up to 200% bonus on your recharges to call all networks. Migrate now by dialing star 312 hash and start a live. Endless connections. Airtel, the smartphone network. Fabulous viewers, I am glad to be here because it's going to be a fun few episode of Trending. Of course, brought to you by Airtel. For your pleasure, Trending shows here every day at 9 a.m. and 8 p.m. Well, the guest I have here with me today is someone that has been in the music industry for such a long time. He's known for always speaking his mind. Um, what if his songs actually go this way? I'm going to try to sing. Don't judge me. <clears throat> Nigeria Jaga Jaga. Everything is kata, kata. Goza, goza. Yes, it goes along that line. You still don't know who I'm talking about? Well, you are going to have to find out who this person is when we return from this break. Stay with me, guys. Igwe, igwe, igwe. Say, you know that we just 200 naira recharge card. I tell they summon me with 200% bonus. Do you more with any network? <laughs> Relax. In fact, I don't buy your own address in every day. Igwe, igwe. Anytime I recharge 200 naira and above, Smart Connect, they summon me with free internet. Buy your address in today. <laughs> Airtel, the smartphone network. Welcome back. Thank you so much for sticking with me. It's still trending, brought to you by Airtel. Now, I'm sure you'll like reveal the guest already. No, okay. Look, our guest today happens to be no other but Idris Abdul Karim. Yee, yee. Hello. What up? How you doing? I'm good. You. I'm good. You know, a lot of people perceive you to be a vicious person of violence, and then you come in here and he's all smiles and you're so friendly and you're a completely different person than what people think you are. It's a beautiful thing. That means you're somebody, something, there's something special about you. Really? Because you're not like that to everybody? I don't have to tell you. Why don't you find out yourself? Ah, that means I have to follow you. Just like that. you just did, you know? Yes. Well, uh, anyway, it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. It's It inspires me to write more. Okay. So it's a beautiful thing. But Amazing. people who are close to me know me very well. Yes. That's right. Well, I've known you for a few minutes and I think you're an amazing person already. Thank you. All right, so you are qualified for our style update segment mm. where you get to talk about what you're wearing, uh, the inspiration behind it, and just give us a clue and, you know, how you put everything together for today's interview. Anyway, you know, I love to look smart, mm -hmm. you know. Uh, <clears throat> some people say, you know, anyway... I can judge it through your dressing though. I don't believe that. Yeah. I just want to dress to satisfy myself. Mm -hmm. You know, I wear three quarters every day of my life. Ooh. You know, so. Um, Is it something you're affiliated yeah, with? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> My dude is wearing a tricotta, they're like cream so you, We just like it. It's simple. Mm. You know, we don't believe in all that. You know, you need to wear these to mm. look this proper, mm. to be corporate and all that. I don't like all that ceremony. What mm. really matters is who you are inside. Oh, absolutely. You know, and fashion is beautiful too. Mm. So. Amazing. Well, um, Idris, speaking about controversies, there's something that happened um, early 2000s. Um, the controversy or the controversial story about yourself and 50 Cent mm. on the plane. Mm. Now, I know this story is stale, mm. but the thing about it is most people got to hear one side or mm. got to hear sides that were published or were, you know, mm. played with. Mm -hmm. Now, I want you to say exactly what happened on the plane and how everything went and how you settled and, you know, just your own encounter from yourself. Like, Okay. Um, first of all, um, 
that was um, about time when I drew up Nigeria Jaga Jaga. So um, Wyclef was in town, uh, and uh, a month later I was in Germany, and um, uh, a call from Nigerian Buries, okay. which is my best multinational, even up till today, today you yeah. know, because um, Nigerian Buries had advantage in my life, okay. you know, my first millions that I made, mm -hmm. apart from Rootman's Groove, was from Nigerian Buries, okay. yeah, mm -hmm. and um, they're my family and I love them, I appreciate them, yeah, mm -hmm. but my problem is with the agent, you understand, mm -hmm. that represents Nigerian Buries, mm -hmm. I had an agreement with you that whatever you're giving 50 cents, that's what you're giving Idris, uh -huh. if you're giving 50 cents an executive room, I want my room to be opposite this room, if you're giving 50 cents, 17 jeeps and just five people gonna be in the jeeps i want to have 17. Mm -hmm. if you give me 50 cents 17 cartons of champagne don't bring your own crystal i want to have the same thing why first is that we are nigerians we are the one drinking these products we are the one buying these shares and at the same time you know we are the one promoting these beautiful brands mm -hmm. you understand mm -hmm. and the reason why you bring a foreign artist is to be able to match it together and let's see how you can add value to our lives not to come and oppress us do you understand so i had an agreement with the agent and okay. i said this is what my right and this is what i want so he got it he signed he said he told me all right no problem i'll talk to the md and i'll get your uh, copy back to you i said okay beautiful no problem why not okay. so on my way home i got an alert you know I was like, okay, cool, no problem. So on the day of the event, I was on a plane uh, with my crew. Yeah. Everybody, you know, was on the economic class. So mm -hmm. my deal was business class because I told you whatever you're giving 50, that's what you're giving me. Yeah. You know what I mean? So um, I sat on the class and um, we wait, waited for 50 and it's cool for almost about two hours. So wow. they finally came and... Um, they talked to the organizer like, hey, there's somebody on 50th seat. And uh, so the organizer didn't do anything. And the organizer didn't walk up to me, you okay. know. So um, 50 and his crew approached me and like, yo, you got to get the F out of that seat. That's 50 cent seat, you know, if you know what I mean by F, uh, you know. So, so uh, like, excuse me. We don't speak F in Africa. I don't know what F is all about. <laughs> My name is Dries, and I sold 4.6 million copies in a pirated country. Mm. Why don't you sit here and tell me how did the American market work? Wow. Uh, so we can learn from you. It was like, oh, yeah, you're performing alongside with me? Okay, I'll talk to the organizer. I went back down. Mm -hmm. I was waiting from the window, you yeah. know, and 50 manage management was discussing with the organizer, and the organizer was like, no. So. 50 and yeah. a cr his crew came back to me and were like, yo, we just spoke with the organizer. They said they don't know who you are. What? Before I know what's up, they got me locked down, neck hand. Oh my God. You know, and funny enough, my, my, my crew came, you know, to support to me. Yeah. So to rescue me. So I closed the plane. But meanwhile, there were me, hundreds of Nigerian artists in the plane. Mm -hmm. And all they just did was down. like this. Down. Like they didn't give a ish about what's going on. Whoa. You know, so I was like, excuse me, hold on, wait a minute. I was like, okay, I don't, I don't blame you guys. Do me a favor. I'm very sure not everybody here has education. I guess you should go back and read the history of Rosa Parks, the black woman mm -hmm. that said enough is enough, that sat in the chair. Mm -hmm. And like, you see, you're watching an American, you're humiliating your brother, and you couldn't do anything. You talk. I was hearing one of them saying that, Watch, 50 cents goes some bitter now, you know. You after, don't say. Yeah. So I was like, okay, this is where it is. So I jammed the plane, okay. the door. I pick up my phone, call Asari Dokubo, call Charlie Boy, call Festus Guillermo, call my crew from SMS, Ekumog, uh, you know. I have a lot of soja on the street, you know what I'm saying? And I empowered them, any IB, you understand? So yeah. my crew came up with the uh, mode to block everywhere, you know. So it was a war. Wait, all this so, happened? In the plane. So they were getting, yeah, at the, oh yeah, at the Kenja to block the old road so nobody's going anywhere. Yes, what? now it, it, it has to be the, blocked everybody, Kenja. Oh, wow. That's it, you block everybody, nobody's going in, nobody's coming out. Yeah, that's where it is. You know, basically, so I said, you know what, 
enough of all this, you know. So, <laughs> uh, we're finally opened the <laughs> the door, yeah. and uh, the MD yeah. walked up to me and said, "Hello, Mr. Idris. Yeah, take it easy. You know, we're sorry about everything that happened. Um, Fifty Cent asked you to come, have a handshake, so you guys can move on to the next show in Polarco." I was like, "Are you kidding me? Like seriously? I was like, oh my God." Your great grandfather was taken away from Badagri, Agbadarigi, 500 years ago. You're coming to Africa for the first time to teach us sex, law, drugs, and how many gunshots in your body. Amazing. Now, you mentioned um, the former president, Olu uh, yeah. His Excellency Olu Shekun Basanja. What happened between both of you? Mm, nothing, I guess. Um, like I said, two treaties Peter, he came back from Egypt. 2004, mm -hmm. February, um, after representing uh, Nigeria and no, Africa. Okay. You know, to raise the Olympic torch. Okay. Uh, I'm an Olympic torch bearer. Mm -hmm. And that was the best thing that ever happened to me. Really? Though. I mean, Olympic is big. I'm telling it's you, it's worldwide. Unity, togetherness, yes. you know, so. How did you get that? Oh, Nigerians voted for me. Oh. You know, about 19 million Nigerians. Wow. It's a contest. Amazing. Sponsored by Coca Cola Africa. Oh. So, me, Professor Pati Tomi, Dora Kinyuli, um, Shed Modegwami, um, Yinka, but a few other great Nigerians represented, mm -hmm. you know, and it was beautiful. Uh, the moment that Pastor Tomi passed the touch to me, yeah. uh, I was crying. You were? I was crying. Come on, trust me. You know, for me, it means a lot to me. It's what like, was going through like, your mind? I'm, I'm passing my generation to your generation. Like, wow. That was where I saw, like, it's wow. touching. I see people crying, you know. So, I give God the glory for that. So, I came yes. back and I saw it as a responsibility to do a song. And the song that came up that time was Jaga Jaga. Mm. You know, the country was going through real, you know, financial you know, and corruption problems, you know. And um, I felt like, okay, it's another beautiful thing. I'm done with Mr. Lecture. I'm talking about sexual harassment in our campuses. Yeah. Let me talk about, let me talk about Jaga Jaga, you mm -hmm. know. Mm -hmm. And Nigerians loved it. And yeah. it gives Nigerian opportunity to be able to come out and speak, you know. You know and yeah. um, the president came on the national TV and um, celebrated my family by saying your papa and your mama jaga jaga we that boy we sing jaga jaga and i was very happy wow well you um happen to be one of the pioneers of um uh, rap music in nigeria yeah what would you say you learned back then that still helps you grow discipline well uh, i'm going to ask you uh, mm -hmm. it's a fast fire question segment mm -hmm. where i'm going to um ask you a couple of questions and you're going to answer them in 60 seconds are you kidding me no, like, I'm not. Se seriously. I am very serious. <laughs> like you have to. Sixty answer. seconds. Yes, yeah, sixty seconds. Okay. You don't think at all. You mm. just answer from the top of your head, like. Mm. Yeah. Mm. You ready? Yep. Are you sure you're ready? Most deaf. Okay, let's go. Mm. Favorite phone device. What is your favorite phone device? Apple, trust me. The last thing you bought online. PlayStation. Red wine or vodka. Fuck. Slim or plus size girl? Slim. Light or dark skinned? Dark. How long do you spend in the bathroom? 20 minutes. Trending song for you right now. <laughs> right now? Yeah. Right now? Mm. Like right now. Joel. <laughs> <laughs> Bird gang or clean shave? Clean shave, girl. Uh, favorite Nigerian designer? Kesi Jaba. Laptop or iPad? Laptop. Long term relationship or short term? Long term. Instagram or Facebook? Facebook. Summer or winter? <laughs> Summer for life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you won't be able to. Take me to you. <laughs> <laughs> summertime is a holiday. That's beautiful. Yeah. Cool. So, so you always you prefer summer to winter? No, summer is beautiful. I'm always in Europe. Yeah. Can't wait for this year's summer. Okay, guys, that was awesome. But we need to go on a break now to show you what's trending. My guests and I will be talking about the things trending when we return. But don't be told to stick around. Stay with us, guys. We'll be right back. See ya. <music> 
What's trending? Just in case you were not aware, colored hair is the main deal right now. We have sported several artists and now music legend Madonna has joined the trend wagon. We are quite not sure what we think about the hair, but all we know is that the rebel heart is rocking it. Friends stay close. Friends in the tribe, stay closer. In the tribe, you always know what's up with Facebook, WhatsApp, BB and Twitter. There are no rules with SMS. It's endless. Enjoy very long conversations with that special someone. Enjoy endless connections to your friends with free calls, free WhatsApp, Twitter, Facebook, and BBM. You also enjoy up to 200% bonus on your recharges to call all networks. Migrate now by dialing star 312 hash and start a life. Endless connections. Airtel, the smartphone network. Welcome back guys and of course it's still trending brought to you by Airtel and just in case you did not know not only is Airtel super convenient it also gives you tons of data to stay connected to your friends and loved ones on social media. Well I still have Idris Abdul Karim here with me in the studio and we were talking about those things trending on social media. Now, as we all know, the elections and everything surrounding it are on almost everyone's lips. I mean, everyone at the moment. And um, Idris, you're such a valid guest to talk about this. Yeah. What is your opinion about the elections? Oh, it was beautiful. I mean, Jonathan has been able to prove to people that he's a peace, peaceful man, you know? I mean, yeah, it's, it's my, I'm, I'm, I'm his number one fan. I love everything about Jonathan. You know, he's my hero. Mm -hmm. You know, for what he did is the most, nobody, I, ca I can't believe. I just, up till now, yeah. uh, I can't believe Jonathan is this peaceful. This, okay. this, this man is my hero. I love him. Amazing. So, so the election has come and go. Boris, yeah, you know, so wish him all the best. He's our president, you know, whether we like it or not now, you know, so. You like it. Do you support him? No, I'm not a Bwari fan. I'm okay. a good luck fan. But at the same time, we don't have a choice. It's the, president, the president, you know. So, you know, we let it go. You Did know you what I mean? Oh, well, most definitely, yes. So you voted for Jonathan? Most definitely, yes. What was your reaction when you found out that um, Bwari had won? Were you broken or were you just... No, I just let it go. Okay. Just let it go. Mm -hmm. It's not a do or die affair. Now, do you well, think that President Jonathan's regime would be way better than General Buhari's um, regime? <laughs> I can't say basically, you understand. Um, I just believe that Jonathan, for now, mm -hmm. you know, is my hero. Mm -hmm. I appreciate him. You understand? So I wish Bari all the best, okay. you know, to be able to do the things that Nigerians want him to do, okay. you know, and we look forward to a sweet Nigeria. Now, we know the statement from the Opa of Lagos regarding, you know, evil people and saying we all have to, all the evil people have to vote for Ambode. And if they don't, something will happen to them in seven days, they will die, blah, blah. Um, you know about it, right? Um, I think. Nigerians are seeing a lot of reasons why they should be careful about the people we call our leaders, our elders, our fathers and traditional rulers and all that. I mean, if you are a father, why would you on earth mention that kind of thing or say that kind of thing on the national TV? That's very, 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 very not fair. Mm -hmm. I mean, a lot of Igbos have been in Lagos for a long time doing their businesses. Mm -hmm. the, the government hasn't been paying them. They pay yeah. tax. They do a lot of things and they want to do what they want to do. It's mm -hmm. their choice to choose who they want to vote for. You understand what I'm saying? So you don't have the right to say that. Saying that alone, you, I guess you messed, you, they, they've messed up their candidate. I'm here, okay, baby. Now, so we'll move to the lighter part of the show. We have this new segment called My Kana Tribe. Now, this was coined out of Airtel's new campaign, My Tribe, where you get exciting bonuses that allow you better and longer access on social media and instant messages. Now, we'll be playing a game to test how much our guest here, Idris Abdul Karim, knows about social media abbreviations and slangs. Oh, really? Yes. I'm not a big fan of social media, though. Um, but anyway, shoot. It's not so hard. <laughs> now, the first one, ASL. ASL? I don't know what ASL is. Means. It means age, sex, location. Sex, male or female. Not uh, the other. Uh, uh, sounds like the inspiration is coming from some 
um, some, some girls what? trying to take care of business, age, sex, and what did you say? Location. <laughs> no, oh my, oh my God. Oh, Image. did you just understand? Yeah, I just understood what you were going on. I'm like, what? I, I didn't say, say anything. I just... Okay, the second one now is mm -hmm. GPS. Ah, uh -uh, GPS. I will trail you now. Anywhere we do, I'll offer you. <laughs> do you want to say the exact, what exactly, what it means exactly? GPS. Mm -hmm. GPS is a device, you know, that locates you, but I don't really know exactly. what the G... Well, you did well. I mean, you know exactly what, it, what it's used for, but it means global positioning system okay for the it people good yes. i've just said thanks for educating me on that one today yeah. i got it that yeah so you always but i know gps is yeah. a but device that could be like global good. positioning system instead of saying gps like global positioning system it yes. people okay i got no, it you just be like nancy thought I got it, it is Nothing. Oh yes, I'm gonna put it in a song as well. You know. You are. Yeah, it's inspiring. <laughs> Life is about learning yes. every day. But that was so much fun. And it um, is so much fun. Yeah, it is. It's always fun. I mean, I've been with you for a few minutes, but it's fun being with you. So. Yeah, it's a beautiful thing. Life is a beautiful, beautiful. world. You yes. know, we learn every day, and um, I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to have you here. Well, that was so much fun, guys. But we need to go on another break. And when we return, it will be time for Nasty. Mm, nasty. Igwe, igwe, igwe. Say, you know that with just 200 Naira recharge card, I the summer me with 200% bonus to yam more with any network. <laughs> Relax. In fact, I don't buy your own address in Nigeria. <laughs> Anytime I recharge 200 naira and above, Smart Connect they suffer me with free internet. Buy your address in today. Airtel, the smartphone network. Welcome back guys, we have gotten to that segment of the show that you guys hate to miss. Now, this is the nasty comment segment where my guest gets to read out some of the nasty comments that um, his fans have left out for him <laughs> on social media. Trust me, I always like to say this to people who love <laughs> I him. love that, you know. Yeah. I love that. You love that. Okay, mm -hmm. so amazing. That should be easy then. Mm -hmm. um, so, here you go. Okay. No, you will boo this thing wide I know that this is very well. <laughs> All right, Tinedu <coughs> said, Idris, you're just hypocrite. See how you're changing mouth for chicken and rice. Anyway, uh, they said, um, well, after they said, Idris, you're a shame. You're still shining off one song. No, I have seven albums and all of them are hits. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I don't know if you laugh or. <laughs> it said, um, it said, life said, this uh, Godfather just give up already. Most mo music is not for you, but I created music and I made everybody where I are today. So, oh. how can you say that? Because <laughs> she said, this man, see how you don't, you don't far finish. Are you still the are you, are you, are you still they look for money to blow, to blow up again? No, nigga. First of all, let me answer by saying that. Okay. <clears throat> it's obvious that you are just jealous you can't be like me. Okay. Secondly, mm, you're free to say whatever you want to say, but it is important for me to answer you that I have been making my money before the government. I'm a self-made millionaire mm -hmm. and um, I've not met Jonathan before. And at the same time, it's the best thing that ever happened mm -hmm. to Nigeria, even though we know people like Baba created the whole insecurity just to make him look like a stupid person. Wow. <coughs> and also, for you, Mr. Kolechi, I have been here for a long time, and I've been able to add value to the lives of a lot of people. Please show me how many people where you don't create employment for. Thank you. Well, thank you so much for that, Idris. That's, you handled it like a trooper. <laughs> Come on, I've been there. 
Done no, that. that yeah. One t-shirt, don't mind. <laughs> well, I am so grateful to you for coming today on the show. Um, you're such an amazing guest. Thank and, you. Um, thank you for being so kind to me. I'm happy to be here. You know, every day is about learning. Yes. You know, so it's beautiful. I'm happy to be here. You know, yes. well, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> if you're going to say that, you should please do not think you're speaking Hausa. It's actually German, and it means thank you. And I just want to say thank you to you guys. But before we go, we're going to go on a quick break to check out our top five. Enjoy. Here are our top 5 male quick style tips. At number 5, fit is king. Make sure your clothes fit impeccably, not too tight though. At number 4, invest in top notch shoes. Shoes add to your overall outfit, so make sure your shoes are on point. At number 3, less is more. Don't overdo it. At number 2, be sure to add accessories to get that edgy look you need. And at number 1 on our top 5 male quick style tips is Confidence is everything. Follow fashionless and cultivate a personal style. Friends stay close. Friends in the tribe stay closer. In the tribe, you always know what's up with Facebook, WhatsApp, BB, and Twitter. There are no rules with SMS. It's endless. Enjoy very long conversations with that special someone. Enjoy endless connections to your friends with free calls, free WhatsApp, Twitter, Facebook, and BBM. You also enjoy up to 200% bonus on your recharges to call all networks. Migrate now by dialing star 312 hash and start a life. Endless connections. Airtel, the smartphone network. Guys, it's sad, but we have to go now. Make sure you keep the conversation going on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Catch new episodes of Trending brought to you by Airtel Air every day by 9 a.m. and also by 8 p.m. Now, thank you so much for watching and get an Airtel soon today. <laughs> thank you so much for watching. My name remains Nancy Smith. Goodbye for now. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.